Hello, welcome to the IDX Broker Dynamic Wrapper video. This tutorial should help you create your very first dynamic wrapper. If you are using WordPress, there is an automated way to do this, and you can find additional help on support.idxbroker.com. Create a new page on your website. Title the page something that will be appropriate for all of your IDX pages. Do not add this new page to your navigation menu. The graphics and layout of this page accepting the content will be duplicated for your IDX pages. This process should work with any website builder or CMS that uses absolute links. Determine where the IDX content needs to be displayed on the page. This is usually the main content area of the page. Here we will be adding tags for IDX Broker to determine where to place the IDX content. You can copy these tags from our knowledge base article on dynamic wrappers. It will look like this. If you are using a website builder or CMS, this will need to be in text or HTML mode and not WYSIWYG view. In the IDX Broker dashboard, select Design, Website, and Wrappers. Choose the wrapper you would like to work with, Global, Categories, Pages, or Save Links, and choose Dynamic as the type of wrapper. On this screen, you will see a field to paste in a URL. Paste in the address of the page you created previously on your website and hit save. You can visit any of your IDX broker pages to verify it worked. That is the basics of creating a dynamic wrapper. If you have any issues, please reach out for additional support at support.idxbroker.com.